Joe has been my mentor, my supporter. He's been by my side for this entire journey. And I want him by my side as you install me. And I said, that sounds great. Because it's one of the characteristics that makes you, Linda, a great lion and a great leader. You have a strong sense of family and understand to a deep degree the human side of our organization. You bring all that along with excellent communication and technical skills, a well-developed knowledge of our organization, and just like the rest of our executive team, a deep dedication to our district and to your position as First Vice Minister Governor. You also have a clear vision for the future and a commitment to change. You and the rest of this dream team are already floating ideas of change that will enhance membership, enhance leadership, the ability to deliver service to our communities, you and more as a second vice minister governor. You and your fellow executive team members set the bar very high for what it looks like to work as an effective team. You are an integral part of your council at the state level and they're stronger for your efforts. Thank you for all you've done for this district and the state of California as second vice district governor. Having said all that, LCI also has a set of expectations for you as first vice district governor, and I'll be sending those in electronic form to you later this evening. Exactly. By the powers invested in me, to me, in sunny Seattle, it is my honor and privilege to install you as the second vice or first vice district governor for District 4C6 for the year 2020. Congratulations, Linda. Thank you, Liz. Governor Governor Aaron Fillmore will now introduce uh, our new starting officer.